We are getting some, at least portions of North Texas getting in on some of that heavy rain. Take a look right now. Uh, scattered storms started rolling this way early in the afternoon, and we've seen those becoming a little bit more widespread. So, where they lie, mainly west and north of Dallas Fort Worth, take a look right now, stretching up from around the Red River and then back towards Breckenridge. Heavy, heavy rain and lightning in the mix. A bit of an outflow boundary has also formed, and that's where we've seen some of those be able to push into the Metroplex. So, you can see some of that. Uh, spotty heavy rain at times for Denton. Now some of that headed towards Melissa, that lifting off to the northeast. And then as we turn back to the west, you can see some of that headed towards uh, Decatur in the next half hour. Bowie getting in on that rain as well, and Mineral Wells getting the rain too. So again, thankfully nothing that's severe, but certainly some heavy rain that may uh, be tough, make it tough going the next little bit as we move on into the next couple of hours. Uh, you can see some of that rain pushing around the Red River. Fairly light, but the heavy Heaviest spots have been back off to the west. Jacksboro down to around Mineral Wells. Storms again moving off to the northeast. So we'll keep that 20% chance of a storm as we move on into the evening period. Once the sun goes down, activity should quickly diminish. And again, any spots west of I 35 and then just north of Dallas Fort Worth have that best shot to see some quick, heavy rainfall. Taking a look from Dallas right now, wow, hot, hot on this Sunday. Lots of sunshine 103 right now. That is the right number. You're not seeing things. Uh, dew points have been quite high. Our feels like temperatures are over 100 degrees, and our south wind has been pretty breezy through the day today as well. And look how uh, widespread our numbers are in the low 100s. That's Allen at 100, as well as Addison, uh, Heath 104, Fort Worth 102, Arlington at 103. And then where you've gotten the rainfall back around Bridgeport certainly brings the number down 88 around Bridgeport, Decatur at 83. Feels like temperatures, though, for the most part, will stay this evening just over 100. Now, I mentioned we've got another shot to see some rainfall in the coming days. It still looks to be on 4th of July. So I know it's not good timing. We'll be watching this disturbance from the Gulf start to lift this way, and especially southeast of the Metroplex. Heads up for 4th of July. We'll be watching some scattered showers and thunderstorms, especially as we get into midday and into the afternoon. 30% chance for July 4th. Additional rain chances, though, will come into play next weekend. For tonight, 78. Tomorrow, a dry forecast, 102. A hot, hot start to the week, and numbers coming down just a bit later on this week.